All right, guys. Hey, uh, Andrew Alvarez uh, versus Real Woods here, and uh, man, what an what an awesome move uh, to hit this in the NCAA championships, and uh, you know, get this inside trip. Uh, you know, when I first saw it, I was thinking of like uh, you know Joseph uh, Vincenzo uh, from Penn State. You know, him and those battles with uh, Marinelli. Uh, and, uh, you can see he has an overhook and then, uh, he gets his hips in and then this leg hook is so important because it lifts, uh, real woods, uh, foot off the mat. And so, uh, I want to go into this, uh, you know, who was the master and who, Maybe the grandfather, the the man that that started this uh, inside trip, and uh, his name is is Kendall Cross. So let's let's go to you know Kendall Cross and man, you know it's almost like history repeating itself. So here's a, a this is for a world championship. Uh, well, this is for the Olympic trials, so the best in the country, and you know he's doing it against an Iowa guy. Terry Brands, uh, and doesn't that look familiar, that little hook of the leg? And you see how he got uh, Terry Brands' uh, leg up? And then, you know, it's almost like a false sense of security uh, here. But once he lifts the leg, uh, then it's like, a, you know, it's a situation uh, that favors, you know, Kendall Cross. And, uh, you know, does history repeat itself? Uh, I don't know. I mean, the Spencer Lee just had a, a, a terrible uh, uh, upset, uh, very similar to Dan Gables uh, from Iowa uh, so many years ago, even though he wrestled for Iowa State. Uh, but uh, do I believe in that? I, w I would say no. <clears throat> uh, but uh, there's definitely patterns uh, that we can learn uh, from history. And uh, this right here, this move, uh, is is awesome to learn off of Kendall Cross. Let's watch him. Let's watch him do it again. Uh, so you can see here that he's doing the same thing. Notice how he's catching that that leg and and kicking it out. And you know how do you? How do you end up doing, you know, a, a move like this? Well, there's a couple principles that that I want to discuss, uh, but first I want to show you guys, you know, how how it has evolved. So, you know, this is Kendall Cross when he wrestled for Oklahoma State, and uh, you know, you can see that he's doing an inside trip. And he's coming down to his knee and and taking him just straight straight down. So it's a little bit different, uh, you know, than see how he's, you know, there's a transfer of the head, the inside trip where we're catching the leg. But this big transfer, see how his head's moving from one side to the other? He has a high, really high elbow here up in his armpit. And... Uh, Man, it's really good stuff. So let's go over some of the technique. So here's uh, Kendall Cross showing the move, and he's just showing his inside trip. And you can see that you know he's he's getting the the right pressure. And guys, that is the key. See how he's blocking off with this arm, and you know he gives ground a little bit. He takes this little back step, but he needs this right leg, this hip close to his. So right at this point right here, he's getting his hip close. He's making that head transfer. And then, you know, he's just looking for an inside trip to take him straight to his back. Uh, you know, but but it evolved in, into, you know, this where, you know, hey, we're like getting this huge arch and turn and, and, and tossing him. Uh, so I'd love to see, you know, this is this is a exciting move and, you know, and you could see that his arch right there uh, was awesome. And it's it's coming into freestyle season. So, you know, 
probably the very first thing that you want to start working on is this this back arch. And uh, the one thing that, you know, I used to do backflips uh, uh, several years ago. And one of the biggest things is to be able to look uh, at the mat right here is to arch your head so you actually can see straight behind you. A lot of people don't get this arch in your head. And you can see that, you know, that's a, that's a great uh, drill uh, to do. Uh, another one is same thing. Look, see how he's looking behind right here to get this arch. And it's a great drill with, you know, a partner uh, that you can do. But the big thing is, is getting your head right. See how he's up on his toes. Uh, that's, that's good stuff as well. And here's the same thing. We're doing this, this back arch with a partner. And, you know, you want to look directly behind you. So you want to be uh, completely like almost upside down. Uh, and then, you know, you can start getting into, you know, by yourself with, uh, you know, more, more of a, a back arch. And then, you know, when you start getting really good, you know, you can, you can kind of start <clears throat> doing back arches where you're almost doing like a, a back flip uh, there. So I think this is a great move to uh, get us into uh, freestyle season and, you know, the inside trip. Uh, awesome. Uh, just remember uh, that I would I would probably start with just a regular inside trip where you're getting a getting a takedown like into a double. <clears throat> and then, you know, the opportunity will come around where you're going to be able to start working with this and get a get a good feel for it. All right, guys, have a great day.